Hi, this is Rashid from ITLX. Today I'll show you how to convert a string GOID uh, for record uh, to entity reference and use it inside the workflow in Microsoft Dynamics. So let's first uh, show you what is the output after that. Let's discuss. Okay, so here for example, we have this one. So all we need, we want to, when we click run uh, the workflow, okay, the workflow should copy this one, okay. So let's come here, this one, yes. I have here uh, like this one, workflow. This workflow consists of this uh, our normal uh, or usual if you follow me from the beginning um, a lot of series and a lot of videos before this is uh, itlic workflow workflow helper this takes nothing and uh, retrieve uh, the output is like that here if we come here in this one workflow helper there should be like uh, workflow ent entity for the entity which uh, fire the workflow and record id current record id okay so let's say here i want this record id it will retrieved as a string so here we have a string okay then we we want by from this string to generate a lock okay so here we have this uh, action i will i will show you exactly how this action works and everything this is action just take the string okay after that this action returns the here if we come here and let's go this is the action return the lookup okay yes yes come here and select and save and close let's make it uh, sure it's on demand okay let's activate active let's refresh this grid let's run the workflow let's back here let's refresh this here's the workflow and here is the action return uh, lookup and we use this lookup so uh, this action is like uh, empty action okay let's uh, see the action here here is the action it just has like uh, input parameter the input parameter must be it is must the name must be input id and the output must be output lockup okay and in the output lockup we should as uh, select which entity here so it's everything here like uh, configurable so if we click here this is string to lockup converter entity I can this is the name of the entity okay I, I I am doing the demo on this entity okay so let's show you now how to set up the after you create the this action you should come in the plugin registration tool and just assign new step this is a step just to give it the name of your action okay and make sure you're using this plugin called the string to lookup convert converter plugin and and it will retrieve the uh, will assign the value string GOID to the lookup so you can use it in any visual 
uh, workflow okay thank you for watching